hey everybody welcome to my channel if y'all new if you've been watching me then of course welcome back so you guys in today's video i am going to be changing the fabric on this set that i got from offer up okay so starting out i'm going to unscrew the bottom part of it off of the chair and i'm going to take my fabric and lay my fabric over it and i'm gonna just cut around it the size it Once I cut everything off that I wanted, I stapled it. I didn't get that part, but I just stapled it all the way around, laid it on top, and then screwed it back on to the chair. For the bench, I'm going to repeat the same step that I did for the seating of the chair. I'm going to unscrew it, then I'm going to lay my fabric down and size it, cut around it, and then staple it. The way that I staple it is how I stapled the bottom seat of the chair. So that's basically what I did the first time. I just didn't catch it on video, but yeah, this basically the same steps you're gonna do. So for the tufting part, I took the staple and I just, everything I do, I just eye it. I don't measure or nothing. I just eye it everything out. So basically, I take my fingers and see where I want to staple the holes at for the tufting. And yeah, I just do that all the way through. Just eye it out. You can measure it though. If you want your stuff perfect, you can measure it. Definitely measure it. Now onto this high back bench, I am going to take a mattress top and I'm going to cut around it and size it for the top and the bottom and I'm going to staple around it, staple it up there and yeah y'all, y'all basically get the gist. I really don't have to talk this through y'all but yeah, I'm just trying to make sure y'all get the point.
so for the tough thing you need a needle thread and the buttons and i'm going to take one end of the string and put it through the needle then i'm going to put it through the button and then i'm going to tie it in a knot Again, I eye everything or size it with my finger. So once you find a placement where you want your hole, you're going to stick the needle all the way through and then cut the needle off of the string. Now that you cut the needle off the string, you're going to now put one end of the string into the button and then you're going to take it and tie it in a knot tight but not too tight because you can pop it as you'll see me do later on throughout the video. But yeah, just tie it like a good three, four times. Tie it as tight as you can, not too tight. But yeah, and then after that, you have your tuft. So basically throughout the rest of this video it's kind of self-explanatory i'm not going to talk y'all head off too much but yeah i try to show you guys step by step as much as i could if you guys need help understanding something just let me know but i feel like the rest of this video is kind of self-explanatory so make sure you guys like comment subscribe comment more video ideas and comment some decorating videos for me to do